Welcome to the Extreme Vampire World Podcast, or Extreme Vampire's World Podcast, however you want to say it. And I would like to, I am podcasting, starting this podcast with Anchor, F.FM. Anchor is the easiest way to make a podcast. Anchor gives you everything you need in one place for free, which you can use right from your phone or computer. Creation tools allow you to record and edit your podcast so it sounds great. They'll distribute your podcast for you so you can be heard everywhere. Spotify, Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, and many more. And I, trust me, I am now on Spotify and I love Spotify because I can get any kind of, like, music from, like, past and present. And now I am in the family of Spotify. You can find me on Spotify, but also on Anchor, which you have to start first. You can easily make money from your podcast with no minimum listenership. And you have to download the Anchor app on your device or go to anchor.fm. That's A-N-C-H-O-R dot F-M to get started. And now, please enjoy the podcast. Well, I thought I'd uh, make a special bonus episode because, uh, you know, just to do it. This is an old recording that I did about, mm, I don't know, well, when Lenny from Motorhead died. And because of the wrestling tie-in, I thought I'd do a podcast at the time. And it's, you know, I found it online and I thought I'd share. So... Here it is. After the break, there's going to be, you know, I'm going to have it. It's not very long, but it's a bonus episode today. So thank you for listening and see you in a little bit with more podcasts from the extreme, from Extreme Vampire, not the extreme, but this is my podcast from hell. And here's my tribute to Lenny. Hello everyone, this is Extreme Vampire, and welcome to the first Extreme Vampire podcast. Um, Here we talk about pro wrestling, television, movies, music, pretty much everything, but as as you've noticed, I put pro wrestling on top of that list because that's what this podcast, that's what I do, that's what I watch, that's what I... I'm all about pro wrestling. I've grew up, grown up watching it since I was like born because um, my dad and my older brother would watch it when I was born. Basically, they babysat me, and I pretty much grew up from the '80s on to today. And whether it's good or bad, which these days it's awful, I will report it right here. On this podcast. Now, this is the very first one, and it's almost the end of 2015, and it's almost the end of Monday night, and I have not watched Raw yet. Um, I usually watch it on Tuesdays because I am busy doing other things, and so I do not have much to report on that. Um, Maybe I'll come in with a raw report later this week. I don't know, but until then, we're going to see how this goes. What I do have to report is the passing of a legend, and that is Lemmy from Motorhead, Ian Kilmister. He passed away from a battle of of cancer, an aggressive form of cancer, that... Basically, he was diagnosed two days ago, and it killed him today, so rest in peace, Lemmy. Um, You know, he basically um, is one of the uh, uh, most iconic rock stars, musicians in heavy metal, in British heavy metal. He had a distinctive voice and a distinctive sound. Nobody else sounds like Motorhead, and 
I know I said I talk about everything, mostly pro wrestling, so this is a tie-in into pro wrestling, because we all know Motorhead has um, been doing theme music for Triple H, for Evolution, for Triple H again, and I believe he, they were going to work on another one if it hasn't been done already, and... You know, there's been tweets by Triple H, by Stephanie McMahon, today by other wrestlers, you know, showing their respect to, uh, even me, even I have tweeted out my respects to, uh, to Lemmy, and, you know, I grew up listening to Ace of Spades pretty much hundreds and hundreds of times in my whole life, and... Just recently, they were used. That song was used for the NXT Takeover London special uh, pay-per-view and on the network. And now, he, two less than two weeks later, he's not. Now he's not with us. So very sad, you know. Very iconic man, very iconic star in music, and not just in the music industry, not just in the hard rock, but in music in the music industry altogether. And this is why it is very important to know to uh, point to put this on the history books as a monumental point in life, really, for anyone's life who has ever grown up listening to Motorhead or or hard music altogether because anybody has been a fan of hard rock music metal you have uh, you know of Motorhead and know of Lemmy he is God Lemmy is God and that's a joke from the movie Airheads they asked uh, who would win any fight between Lemmy and God and there's a trick question because the answer is Lemmy is God and that, that is a funny scene in um, Airheads with uh, from the 90s. A, uh, eh, it's a funny movie. But uh, uh, we're not here to talk about that. We're here to talk about Lemmy himself. Um, Ace of Spades, one of the most iconic songs of all time. I mean... Who hasn't heard that song? I don't know if you haven't heard it. Check it out. YouTube it. SoundCloud it. I don't know. Find it. Um, I don't want to spend too much on this because this is my first. Uh, I just want to see, check out this, see if I can post this up online. And if not, then I'll find another way to make this podcast happen any anyways um the wrestling tie-in is that you know um triple h loves motorhead um has used uh the band's music to play triple h's theme music for the game for evolution and for the king of kings and like i said another one was supposed to be made i don't know if they recorded already or we don't know yet but um very sad. He by he just got diagnosed with cancer, and two days later, today he passes away from it. And you know, it was a very aggressive form of cancer. Two days ago, he was said to be doing fine. I mean, his the band on the band's Facebook, he said he was at home when he was diagnosed. He was playing video games, his favorite video game, and was with his family at the Rainbow. And, um, you know, he was 70 years old, you know, uh, pretty up there in age, but not quite. I mean, I have, uh, family members that are in their 90s, and they are still kicking. But, um, that's what happens, and it's very sad to hear this and I am upset. I have dedicated this show as a tribute to Lemmy and 
everything he has done for the in pro wrestling in the WWE and uh, his legacy will continue on even in death just like many others and it's sad that another rock star had to pass away only in the span of 30 days when Scott Whalen passed away and I have videos on YouTube Extreme Vampire is the channel um, and I shared like music of Scott Wiley and I'll do the same for Motorhead and Lemmy but um it's very sad um there's not much to report I mean I just wanted to pay tribute by shooting this podcast I guess and letting everyone know how much he meant to me if there was anyone else that did I didn't grow up listening to, then I wouldn't. I would be talking more about pro wrestling and the things going on. But for this report, uh, for this podcast, I am just going to uh, report on uh, the passing of Lemmy. Um, R.I.P. Lemmy. God bless, and we'll we'll all see you in heaven. Or on the other side, or wherever we go. We'll see you soon. And uh, with that, I want to go to another piece of information. I am going to WrestleMania 32 in Dallas. I don't live that, not too far from from there. Um, and just found out that The Rock has confirmed he will be there at WrestleMania 32. And that's big news, especially to my fiance who... Uh, who is going to go with me, and, um, big news, I mean, that pretty much is going to, uh, get everyone in seats, and, uh, I can't wait for that one, um, News coming up, um, events coming up in pro wrestling, I guess the debut of TNA on Pop TV, they already debuted, and the ratings are really bad for um, their uh, year in review part one, I guess, the best of 2015. The ratings were really low, um, I believe uh, um, 110,000 um, viewers, I guess, and um, it does not look promising this is where the network which is mostly a women's network you know they show reruns of days of our lives on there and i believe that's the lead-in to impact or it was and does not look good now considering smackdown uh aired at the same time a live smackdown um we'll see what happens next week when part two of the 2015 show happens so we'll see what happens anyways um that's pretty much the wrestling news i mean um like i said this is a de dedicated to the memory and the great loss we have today of a great rock star a well-respected rock star lemmy of motorhead he's uh not only a historic figure in uh music in heavy music he's a uh, very much in modern day pro wrestling an icon and i'm sure he's they've gotten new fans because of triple h's uh um dedication to uh having motorhead do his theme music and um Maybe we'll get him in the Hall of Fame this year. Um, that would be cool, because I am going to be in Dallas for WrestleMania weekend. I mean, I'll be there for the... Uh, hopefully, I'll get Lucha Underground. I'll be there for the WrestleCon wrestling show. And uh, WrestleMania. I won't be able to be do NXT, because they're sold out. I won't be able to do Hall of Fame. Basically because I'm going to be at the WrestleCon show, which is going to happen at the same time. 
but I will be at WrestleMania, and uh, that will be my first WrestleMania, and pro wrestling is basically my first love, and I put that higher than anything else. And uh, with that, um, uh, once again, rest in peace, Lemmy. I mean, I'm... Um, uh, follow my Twitter, if you guys out there, um, uh, at Vampire Nick, that's V-A-M-P-Y-R-N-I-C-K 79. That is my Twitter handle. Um, I tweet almost every, pretty much every day. At least ten times a day. Maybe, okay, at least five times a day. I'll retweet here, I'll retweet there. My YouTube channel is Extreme Vampire. I have wrestling videos. I might go off topic of wrestling and do a something about music. I have a uh, another podcast on there called the Extreme Vampire and Jimmy Hart Show that I am putting small episodes on a little at a time. So find that on there. Um, I have li- uh, I I have wrestling videos on there and I will do wrestling reviews my next ones are coming up stay tuned for that um I have a blog um you can find me everywhere I'm all over the internet um I guess I'll have to end this because uh I don't have really much that I prepare that I want to talk about I just wanted to show my um Appreciation for Motorhead and Lemmy, and we'll see what happens, and hopefully things will be okay. Life goes on, and unfortunately life has ended for Lemmy, but his legacy will live on, and uh, we'll all see him one day, once again. I'm sure he's in a better place, and with that, I am going to sign out for the... For this episode, I want to thank anyone that's even trying to listen to this. And thank you so much. Um, share this. Um, go to all my sites that I've mentioned and subscribe and follow and do something <laughs> to support the Extreme Vampire and the Extreme Vampire Network and the Vampire Entertainment basically is what this is it's a part of so